Doing a little bit of an experiment here, I'm still waiting for mods to update for Alpha 17, but I figured in the meantime I could still do a quick little modded series on the side just to see. Um, it's, it's a mess, as you can probably tell by the title of the video. It's... <laughs> It is a mess. We've got Medieval Times on, which I've done before. Zombie Apocalypse, which I'm new to because this usually takes a little while to update. So by the time it finally updates for whichever alpha it is, there's another alpha already coming. The HP Lovecraft Storyteller, because I, I really like the guy. Tiberium Rem Meds, Tiberium from the Command and Conquer series. Um, everyone Halls. Man, this, this order is a bit strange. I've been messing with the order because the... Uh, Call of Cthulhu mods, I was trying to figure out which ones work and which ones don't. Cults doesn't let the world load. Industrial Age doesn't let the world world load. Like, it just, it generates the world, but then it just goes back to the generation menu. You don't even see the world, so I'm assuming it silently crashes. I don't know. Neither of these mods allow it to work, and Cults throws up just an absolute load of errors on the game launch, so... We're just rocking Faction, straight jackets, and Cosmic Horrors there. I tried moving them all over the place, though, in the mod listing. That's why stuff's kind of in disarray. But, uh... Well, if it's an issue, I'll, I'll resort these. But everyone hauls, just... Well, everyone hauls. There's no reason to not haul, really. I always hated incapability of dumb labor. It never made sense to me. Fuses for batteries, just so when they short-circuit and explode, the fuse just kind of absorbs most of it. it makes them pretty worthwhile. The efficient lighting, just because I like having things nice and lit up, and the wattage of standard light bulbs is kind of high. Miscellaneous training for target practice, wildlife tab to see stuff at a glance, expanded prosthetics and organ engineering for fixing up people with severe issues, and a dog set for same deal but with animals. Hospitality, because I like being able to recruit people when they come and visit. Trading spot, just to keep things kind of organized inside the base. And the factions for uh, Tiberium Rim, which it shouldn't be a problem. But it is a lot of miscellaneous stuff. I'd like to rock Psychology. This sounds like a really interesting mod, but I'll have to do it another time because it does not work with Zombie Apocalypse, which I want to try. I'm new to this one. So I'm anticipating this kind of sort of almost working, but not quite, and really just being a goddamned mess, but that's okay. It only needs to get me through like a week or so until I get a more proper modded series figured out. Going with the medieval start that I just made, we're considered a tribe which puts us in the Neolithic tech level, which I wish you could set during scenario editing, but uh, you can't. You can't change which tech level you are, so the research penalty for being an ill-fitting tech level is always going to be there. So as such, I've got the research speed factor set multiplied by 200%, so it's effectively doubled, which puts us at the equivalent of medieval, because we're medieval. Starting with five people, because I just, I like having a large colony. Wood, 320 just to get us by. Berries, that'll feed us for maybe a day or so. A couple longbows, few short swords, just to defend ourselves. Uh, story doesn't really too much matter. Mm. <laughs> I really like the HP Lovecraft storyteller because he's a nice mix between Phoebe Chillax and Cassandra Classic. He hits hard and often, but he takes long breaks between. So, it's a, it's a really nice, really nice mix, and I'll play him on rough, because rough is kind of the normal difficulty. We'll go for a super large roll just for funsies. Suffering is a seed, that'll be fine. Rainfall temperature. Fine. And this looks like quite the mess. Quite the mess indeed. We got here, coastal townsfolk. Not quite on a coast, they're actually in the middle of a road, but that's that's okay. They're, they don't have to be successful. We got GDI there, there's some Nod there. The Pirates. What do you guys, just another... Just another pirate type thing, I suppose. The Crowned Rhino. All sorts of stuff. As far as biome goes, I'm just going to go with something simple. Again, I don't expect this to last very, very long, but if it does, just on the off chance, everything seems to work and it's oddly fun and interesting. Um, I'd like to be able to survive somewhat, so we'll just go with something kind of normal. Sort of, to a degree, a little bit. And uh, somewhat near A road would be good. 
I guess something like that. Mountainous? I'm fine with mountainous, I suppose. I'd like large hills, actually. There we go, large hills. Limestone, sandstone, slate. I need granite, I think, but medieval times... No, it's limestone you need, I think, for medieval times, isn't it? I don't know. There's a quarry thing that you can get in medieval times anyway. Last I knew, anyway. This should be okay. Cold in the winter. Hot in the summer. Well, not terribly hot. That'll be fine. And we'll go with fairly large. 350 by 350. And... There's the factions list, which is very extensive. Because the... God, Jesus, the pirates. Enemy of... <laughs> the mod that allows for more factions puts more bases down and just it, it adds more factions. Otherwise, you're still stuck with four, and because I have so many different types of factions available, it'd be like, here's GDI, and a tribe, and the hostile pirates, and the friendly medieval group. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll, we'll go with that. And as far as the five starting people, just healthy and, well, normally healthy and capable, but I suppose if you're capable of dumb labor regardless, no matter what, um, then I won't really care too much about incapabilities. Really just be healthy, I guess. So what do we got here? We got a... Intellectual, artistic, incapable, neurotic, prostophobe, really good at cooking, mining, getting there with growing. Your brother is Goose. This guy. Whoa, really? That's a much older brother. Okay. Uh, trigger happy and iron will, decent with shooting, social, cooking, growing. Okay, pretty good. Trebo, jealous, uh, power maniac, uh, psychically sensitive, mining, shooting. Okay. Slowpoke, teetotaler, psychically dull, you don't talk, decent with melee, and hard worker, masochist, masochist, whichever, greedy, really good at mining. Okay, I'm generally okay with that. It's just ordinarily if they don't do dumb labor, it really puts you behind. And it's super annoying just being like, I need this hauled. And it seems like the one person you always select for the... Okay. For the... Uh, just like the quick hauling jobs, it's like the person who refuses to haul is always the most convenient one for the task. But that's okay. So, I'll run through the beginning stuff here and name people. For those of you who don't know, I do do a name in-game reward for Patreon supporters. Feel free to check the description and check that out if you're interested. And that will be the only type of self-plug I do. Because I hate when people start videos with five minutes of smash that like button and subscribe and stuff. I don't care what you do. I think that's everybody? Maybe? Okay, yeah. And zombie virus is active. Um, I mean, I hear combat music, and it's a little distracting and a little unnerving. <laughs> I've never done the zombie mod before. I have zero idea what to expect. I hope I don't have to turn music off. We'll see what happens though. Is everybody's health okay? Uh, I don't know. I'm not really sure. Any human bitten by a zombie will slowly die of infection and will be reanimated as a zombie on death. Okie dokie. Hmm. Well, uh, I'll run through the beginning stuff, uh, set of stockpiles. Find a home, and I'll just see you then. Reloaded my game. Music still loops. I went out and disabled, um, the dog said, and 
the organ engineering and prosthetics whatever mod because I think there's a conflict maybe with the zombie mod I remember there always being a conflict and the mod that made them work is no longer up to date and neither mod mentions that they're not incompatible so I'm assuming something changed and it's fixed but I thought maybe there is in incompatibility there so I disabled them just to be on the safe side but it's still looping I don't know why it loops I just imagine it's just because the zombie virus is active and maybe it will die down like we're in sort of tower defense mode for some time I don't know but I've got Ove, Johnny Z, Leva, Rogue, and Ozik as the uh, the starting five. And everybody is already set up just to be on cruise control for a little while. I'll obviously be going through the work priorities later on. Leva is waking up and doing just mm, trying something different with them because they're the hunter. And the idea there is they go out and hunt and then the only time they come back is either when they get a successful hunt or when it's time to sleep. I don't want joy and then anything like I have with everybody else because then they could try to go back out and hunt and then they get halfway out there and realize, oh no, it's time to sleep. Oh, okay. And they head all the way back and it's complicated. So I figure work then immediately sleep, but you get a ton of joy at the very beginning of the day to make up for it. And then Johnny Z wakes up a little bit earlier than everybody else and has his joy a little bit later because he is the cook. So I want to make sure we have breakfast set. And everybody else is just kind of standard work priorities and stuff. Not really worrying too much about crafting right now, but Ove will eventually be doing that after research, which we have to do real, real quick. I got the research bench in what will eventually be one day a kind of tiny freezer. We've got the freezer looking out to growing zones of potato and rice, a quick grow and a longer grow. And that'll be a quick hauling job into the freezer. Remember the research bench is laying here temporarily. The butcher table, uh, corpses will be in here. So you run in here, butcher, it's its own room. People don't see it. It's good and fine. I think there is a medieval version of the butcher table. I don't remember. So I have it forbidden for now. Same with the table and chairs. I think those are standard though. Thank you can probably go ahead and do those but we'll save the wood for now and uh but all the mess will be in its own room so it doesn't affect the actual kitchen's quality we'll have the cooking stuff here or well i guess the hearth will be just sort of in the middle of the room or something like that and we'll just do it that way don't have any bedroom set up yet i'll do that eventually Intend to kind of wall up a little bit. I really don't like walling up, but the game's just plain and simply balanced around doing so, which I find incredibly annoying. So I'm going to see about maybe considering doing that. It's all forbidden for now. As far as the music goes, I really hope it stops looping at some point. And thus this mod is just basically like a tower defense mod, and that's just how it is. Only expect a game to last like a half hour to a couple hours or something. Because if I'm in this for the long haul and music's looping like this. Ugh. Gonna have problems. Because ordinarily it's not so bad. But there's so much dead space between the songs that you don't really notice too too much. But since it's all combat music. It's like combat mode engage and there is no break in the music. It just it loops and there's no sounds at all. Not refrigerated, but it is roof, so stuff won't deteriorate. Chunks don't have anywhere for chunks to go right now. I'll get that done later on by the time we run out of wood, which is pretty soon. They are finished up with growing and working on trees. That actually worked out really well. Hide that for now, and that may not be enough food for us. I know the growing uh, yield was increased greatly for this alpha. I, I haven't really looked at to see how much I know in my other Alpha 17 playthrough we get quite a lot like an awful lot a shitload basically and it's uh it's a little more than I need for that colony right now but with five people I don't I don't know if that'll still be the same thing or not if I were to do strawberries because they're nice to eat raw 
minimum skill 5, which we don't do have. We don't do have. We do have. Ozeke's got it. So I, I could do a small little strawberry plot too. Let's do that. I'll leave a failing. Oh. Just in case something happens and our little medieval hearth thing doesn't get set up the way I want it to. Build a little stool for you to sit on to get it roofed up, walled up. What else we got going on? Steel happening down there. Very nearly finished with that little pocket. I'm not seeing much steel. It must all be hidden inside the mountains. Because usually you see a lot of it exposed so you know where to start mining. Fire starting spree. Oh right, yeah, you do that even though you totally don't need to do that. That's right, you just feel like starting fires. Thankfully it's raining, so... No problem, question mark. Keep an eye on it. Looks like the colonists are sort of automatically handling it anyway. But, uh, yeah, I'm not seeing any exposed steel really anywhere, so I'm just gonna have to blindly mine into a mountain. And see, I mean, that's, that's pretty far away there. I don't know. I guess we'll do sleeping spots... ...in there for now. Soon-ish, that won't be a... Alright, yeah, you don't firefight. The rain will put it out. Feel better though? Kinda? Sort of? A little bit? You don't get catharsis for it anymore? You just do it just to do it now. It doesn't even feel good afterwards. That's good. That's, that's, that's fine. I'm okay with that being a soft break. It's just, it's really... Oh, nice. It's really annoying that it happens just for no reason. They're not feeling bad. They just decide, fuck it. It makes me wonder if it's possible for them to be in the middle of combat and just say, nah, fuck it, firefighting. Or, uh, fire starting spree. I don't know. That'd be, like, super bad timing. Actively running away from somebody and you're just like, nah, it's just some stuff on fire. Ugh. New colony optimism will help people through this first night, but then hopefully we can get this wall finished up and it'll at least be indoors. It'll be a shared bedroom. It'll be a shitty shared bedroom. But you won't be sleeping outside and on the ground. So it should be somewhat okay. Definitely need to get Rogue a nice bedroom. Which... Yeah, that'll be a trick. Because like I said, steel's difficult to come by. I'm really just going to have to mine into this, aren't I? Are you finished up with this down here? <sighs> Pretty much. Just mine in and see what there is to see, I suppose. Got a lot of plasteel there, which is awesome. Just nothing. There's silver, which is good. I do need silver. And there's more steel. Kinda of far away, but yeah, uh, take it if you can see it. Silver will take two. Gold? Yeah, a little bit, maybe. So we'll pause this exploratory mining for now. We'll do that later on. And if I do a little more plant cutting... Uh, it'll put behind... Leave his hauling, but you'll be constructing. We'd really like to be getting the wood for you. So somebody else will be doing plant cutting which would be the researcher, who I want focusing on research. Or a rogue, who's mining. Can't really do a whole lot for it. Could set out to hunt. Leva's the only hunter? Oh, I guess Ozeke after... after growing's done. Hunt, then... Grow, I guess. Oh, that'll be fine. And let's set up... Uh, 
That's just food storage. Food prep. I want to say you still needed a butcher. So I'm gonna unforbid that so we can still hunt. Yeah, that's fine. Two people chopping trees, that'll be okay. And really the pressure is on Lilo. There's no shortage of wood. Basically, they just need to build faster. And that, can we get that hauled somewhere please real fast? And then I'll tell you what, even do a uh, a stockpile here for critical clear all just wood just pull that in for her. make it a lot faster Starvation. Okay, yeah. Let's harvest. This is where we can. I may have needed to start with more food. I really didn't know. A hundred berries isn't much, but uh, I figured we'd have strawberry plants everywhere, which we kind of do. Okay, kind of. And you're not going to do that because it's considered plant cutting, which is what you're currently doing, which is the tree chopping. So for now, cancel the tree chopping and do that instead. Okay. Again, there's no shortage of wood, so we're okay to pause that for now. that berry. Fuck. I will stab, I'll run you through with this short sword. Oh. <sighs> yeah, I'm not sure on the zombie mod. I'm pretty sure that's the one that's just looping music endlessly. And if that's the case, then I'll just get rid of that and I'll put on the psychology mod instead. Because that seems to be a uh, surprisingly significant overhaul. Could be interested to check it out. Yeah, that's almost all that I'm seeing. Okay. Add bill, butcher creature. Uh, strap on floor, do forever. Monstrous corpses. Oh. Uh -huh. Okay, and we can hunt. Hunt a raccoon. That's uh thirty meat. Eh. Could be worse. And it's raining, so hunting boom rat wouldn't be too bad of an idea either. Ooh, a pack of Fuck yeah. I'd like to maybe keep alpaca one day. There you go, boomalopes. They're worth a good lot of meat. And it's raining right now, so definitely try for that. Cancel the raccoons. Go for the, uh... Uh, these guys. Boomalopes. There's some steel. We could just deconstruct steel walls and flooring. I think there's another structure. That's stone. That's steel, yeah. Could always do that too. Now. Are you too? Oh, of course it stops raining now. God damn it. Jesus. Careful. Careful. Okay. Cool. 
I was like, should I intervene? Should I just let him do it? Yeah, colonists are still dumb as hell. Oh no, don't try to arrest him. Try to... Oh. oh right, yeah, you're not a firefighter. You don't put out fires. All you can do is just watch Ozeke burn. Well, shit. Don't... Stop it. You're an idiot. And you can't just go much fire, not in the home area. Ah, yes. Don't leave it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Don't execute it from that distance. God. There you go. A little more rain. Thanks. I think we just have the one corpse. Really difficult hitting them because you know they're they're lying down and prone and everything. That, that that's that's still a thing too. And this is not in darkness and prone. Oh man. So your burns just uh, self tent. No, Leva is a pretty good doctor, I suppose. So that for medical. Can rest until he'll leave it'll uh, work on you, but don't use the medicine. You're hunting Boomlo. Consuming berries now. At least bandage up the uh, the burns and then temperature. Campfire. I guess we have to do that because the research is actually taking a little while. You don't construct. I'm going to just tell you to construct even though you're terrible at it. You're only relaxing socially. Work on the campfire. You're really persistent on eating meat. I can do this stuff. Really? Hmm. Huh. Well, I didn't know I could do that on the uh, campfire. That's interesting. Sure. Do that. Who's the cook? Johnny Z. Okay. Hunger overall looking pretty bad. self tend don't use medicine. You only have a couple burns. Just to maybe, hopefully, possibly stave off any infection. They're not massive burns, surprisingly, even though it literally exploded. Your torso took the uh, brunt of it. I was kind of expecting it to be a little worse. But you're already almost healed up. Nice. So tomorrow we'll cook up some jerked meats, butcher the rest of the boomalopes, maybe hunt a turkey, I don't know. But that'll get us food for a little while longer until we get this guy set up, then it can start cooking the food. And it will still be a few days at least before we start getting some rice. Hopefully the strawberry bushes maybe, <laughs> maybe repopulate. I don't know. Probably should have started with a little more food. That is a lot of just heal root. Which is awesome, but I don't want to waste time doing that right now. There's some bushes. There's a couple more. There's a few more over here. Okay. And yeah, I could do... There it is. There's the infection. Uh, where is it? On your left shoulder, of course. The burn that was almost taken care of. Alright, you get medicine now. Let's harvest some heal root too. Sigh. 